Hello YouTube, I hope everybody is doing great. Today I have a new product from Liligo. It's a, as you can see, T4S3 that was sent to me by Liligo. Thank you Liligo and Jane for sending this out to me. And I have not opened the package and this is just an intro video and I will add the other review to the end of it or to the rest of the video and uh, well I couldn't wait I had to do this on video so this comes bubble wrapped and in this nice box so it comes really nicely secured and uh, wow nice and this is actually I think my first AMOLED uh, product and uh, I can't wait to use it I'm not sh quite sure for what for yet so it comes with this pin header very tiny tiny pin header and a battery connector and what I can see from the pictures that I saw it has an on off switch and a battery because most products do have a battery but no way to turn it on and off so this one does have it and um, so it comes this it comes without case and it comes with this case and you can see the on off switch and uh, I'm really looking forward to see what it can do I will give you just a few info it has an ESP S3 or 8 chip with 16 megabit flash and 8 megabit uh, PS RAM and the display has a resolution of 450 by 600 pixel. So let's let's do this. Ah, nice. And it's a gorgeous little little device. I really like it. So anyway, I do some testing, hook it up, and then we continue this video. Okay, after my initial expressions, uh, I have to correct one thing. It does have 16 megabyte flash and 8 megabyte PS RAM and not 8 bit megabit. So, my uh, mistake on my part. Anyway, um, I did update the initial the factory code with my own location and my <coughs> Wi Fi credentials, and on the first screen, it shows you the the serial number and whatnot. On the second screen, it has the clock with the date and this little guy here dancing. And you also have a cryptocurrency. I don't know which one this is, but you have Bitcoin. And this one here, I don't know what it is. And this one, I don't know either. So, and then you have the weather forecast this is where I live and here are the technical data I have inserted <coughs> excuse me it does have a micro SD card slot I think I forgot to mention that in the first video in the first part um, and I did upload a 15 gigabyte uh, micro SD card in there and Currently it's running on battery, obviously, USB power zero, and uh, I don't know what that is. And then you have the screen brightness, and this thing is very bright. It says here it has 800 uh, CD per meter or whatever. The thing, it's not uh, explained in nits, but uh, it's very, very bright. And then you have an app for your Wi-Fi setup that you can use. And then you have this uh, color screen that you can change the colors. And uh, nothing special, it just shows you what this have. I did not create a code. <coughs> Excuse me. I did not create a code yet. Uh, I figured I'd do something else. And... Um, also here is the on off switch and here are the boot and reset switches as you can see here and it has a nice logo on the back 
that shows the pinout and uh, different connectors that you have. I hope it can be seen. You can pause the video if you like. And anyway, since this pin header has 1.27 millimeter pins, which is it would be next to impossible to solder any wires on here. I did create a PCB, breakout PCB. Let me show you this version here. So it does have the connector for the pinout, so you can solder this in. It would go from the bottom, and it has the pin names what they are and then they are extended to regular uh, 2.5 millimeter pin pin headers that you can use and it has this cut out here on the bottom for your battery connector and it will have four holes that you can either screw using these screws you need obviously longer ones or you can once it's plugged in and then with some double-sided tape you can attach it like that as well so you don't need to screw it down actually so this is what I did and um, I will offer this PCB I have to also talk to Lilygo if they might uh, want to carry this PCB then I would offer it through them or I will put it up on my Tindy store where Lilygo also sells their items and sell it there and if you have any interest please do let me know there's obviously some room on here and uh, if you want I can make you a custom PCB and put some sensors on here like for example this CO2 sensor with temperature that I'm currently using on another product or a MEMS microphone or anything else that you might want to have or a GPS module for example if you want to use it as a GPS uh, device I could add a GPS module on here and that would be obviously wired to the corresponding pins like the TX and RX or if it's I2, I2 square sensor to SDA and ST, SCL pins which are here you can see and here are the TX pins you have 3.3 .3 volts grounds obviously you has all you have also the VBUS power which will be 5 volt close to 5 volt depending on your USB and um, anyway and this is how it looks currently it's just simple routed PCB so if as I said if you're interested I will offer these um, on my Tindy store and you can request if you like uh, for additional cost to for me to put any kind of sensor on here that you like to have and um, other than that it has really and I said it before in my first part it is AMOLED display so the blacks are black there is no color or no backlight bleeding through and it's very very nice and um, yeah I think I covered all that you have the how they call it the quick uh, quick connectors I'm not familiar with them quick quick JST connectors here one is for TX RX and one is for I2 square and you can also attach a external antenna if you do not like the reception of the internal you can attach an external antenna as well and your battery is here so overall it's very very nice little board and uh, if you have any ideas what I could build with this, please do let me know. And um, if you have any questions, again, please leave them in the comments. And you can support me by hitting the like button and clicking the 
notification bell and subscribe or buy something from a Tindy store or buy me a coffee or simply hit the thanks button the super button on the bottom of the video anything will help so this was it thanks to Liligo for sending this out to me and take care everybody